It's Annie, your CW star, here on the set of Vampire Diaries. So you grew up in Canada. What was it like growing up in Toronto? Did you get into acting really early? No, actually, I um, I started in the business quite late con compared to all my other friends. I started when I was 16 or 17, and at first I went to a performing arts high school in Toronto, and I was always kind of dancing and doing gymnastics and performing in, in different ways, but it wasn't um, acting until, until I got an agent and started auditioning for movies and TV shows and stuff. And, that's how it all kind of went from there and turned into what, where and what I am now. Now one thing I have really noticed is this love triangle is starting to form. Can you kind of talk about that a little bit? I mean, is that ex exciting for you? Are you happy that it's, it's really starting to build? I think that um, the show, I mean, I'd be lying if, if I didn't say that there was a love triangle in the future at some point with the poster. It just it foreshadows what's to come at some point. And now you're finally starting to see Although Damon has these two sides, everyone has good and bad in them. Damon has more than the other, but he definitely has a little bit of good in him. And Elena's starting to see it and, and have fun with him and kind of let loose because she's always sort of been the girl who is always looking out for everyone. She's not the lively party type as far as we've seen up until this last episode when she goes to the bar and starts drinking and taking shots and just being herself. And. Damon really brings out the fun, carefree Elena. And so that's why their relationship is starting to build and they're developing a friendship at this point, but who knows what's gonna happen in the future. And you, talking about good and bad, you get to play Elena and Catherine. Do you like playing one or the other better or is it fun to be able to get to do both? That's one of the coolest parts of my job. I'm really lucky because I get to play two characters that are completely different from one another and challenging in different ways. Elena's the girl next door, sweet girl, who's I guess sort of a little bit more like myself. And that's why I have a lot of fun stepping into the shoes of Catherine or getting tightened into the corset of Catherine, I guess I should say, and um, get to be that crazy, conniving, narcissistic, controlling, selfish person that she is. And I get to kill and bite people and put on the fangs and it's just it's it's really cool and fun yeah now one thing I heard about you your birthday is the ninth right mm -hmm. and January. I heard that you just had a big birth a big birthday right your 21st I flew out the whole cast and we all went to Vegas and we just hung out it wasn't it wasn't like a crazy crazy experience but it was really fun and we got to bond and just be outside of the work element for once all together and it was really cool did you get to gamble at all I did gamble for the first time, um, and I was really lucky. I won, um, I, I walked away from the blackjack table with a thousand dollar chip. There you the go. A thousand dollar chip, and I have a picture with me, and it's just, I don't know, it's kind of dangerous, because now I know that, that I can win, and hopefully it won't draw me into the casinos anymore. Yeah. Watch The Vampire Diaries, Thursday nights at eight. The CW on Who TV.